Mr. Show here, and today we're back with another episode of Let's Build a City. So, a couple things I like to mention. Uh, first thing is that I built this off camera. I literally just built it now. Uh, you guys are gonna be frustrated, but it is pretty easy. You guys can pause the screen right now and copy it yourselves. There you go. You can pause the screen. <laughs> And I, I am catching a little bit of a cold at the moment, or like a, a runny nose, kind of like allergies. So if I sniffle or uh, do any of that stuff or cough, it's because of that. So I'm sorry, excuse me about that. Just, uh, I, I warned you guys, okay. So today what we're doing, we're gonna be finishing off these row shops. I think they look pretty cool. They're pretty high as well. And are they doing anything on the map? I don't think so, maybe a little bit, but we're gonna be doing the back and the sides the roof and all that stuff today uh, with with these buildings so uh, first things first we're gonna focus on the sides but there's only two sides because there's only this side and that side so I think it's gonna be uh, pretty easy but hmm we do want like a little bit of a pathway down here because we're not gonna be able to fit another building Maybe we could fit another building, so we don't want to go too far back. I guess until there. Maybe one more. Because I think we could have like an alleyway in between. We could have another building here, like a very thin building. That's very high up as well. And we could have like an alleyway in between. I think that would be... I think that would be pretty sick. So if we go up here. But the side, the back is mainly going to be all flat. If you don't... Uh, we'll probably just have a... A window there and then we continue going back down here something uh, something like this uh, I think we just literally we just continue the color pattern uh, we just gonna bring this down we probably want some windows on the sides here uh, just because I think it's quite necessary It's literally just gonna be something like this, literally. I do like the white as well. I don't the white will wrap around there. Perfect, that's how easy it was. But we do wanna add some windows. No, uh, these ones seem a little bit too high, so we'll just go like that. Uh, for this one, we probably want a window there. And for this one, we want another window there. A really tall window there. Um, I think I wanna bring this one up by one. I think I like that. Yeah, there we go. That looks pretty sick. Um, is that that's literally what the side's gonna be like? I don't think I want windows everywhere. Uh, those. I think what we want to do eventually is to put upside down stairs along there, along the the windows where we can. Or like where we can so we just uh, put some upside down stairs I think and the same thing with the stone brick as well we can even do it here uh, upside down upside down and with the stone brick as well yeah okay uh, but the side looks pretty cool we want to add these uh, upside down stairs so this is oh that's a cute little window I guess that looks Pretty easy, pretty pretty easy window there. Oh, this looks pretty low. Uh, but that looks pretty cool. Then on this side, we want to do something similar. So we just want to get the stone brick along here and some clay. We want to get the clay back again. Um, how far do we go back until there? So we're just going to bring this one down again. Um, clay is going to run, I think, along here as well. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Got one more there. And I have a one window there. <laughs> I think that looks pretty sick. And we just bring this back as well. We just bring it back, honestly. I think that's like the easiest uh, job yet. So we just bring this back. Bring that back. We bring this back like this. 
and I wrap that around. Okay, and we just have to have just a window somewhere. So a window there and a window there. Okay, so that, that was easier than I thought it was. <laughs> and then the back. So this will run. Wait, is this? <laughs> now we'll go to there, and then this one. We run along to here, but we just want it to be flat I think having a flat because uh, that's on the back no one's gonna really pay attention to the back of these buildings so I think if we literally just like copy the same pattern as we did to the front I think it look I think it would look pretty cool I think it would look pretty cool uh, to be we probably don't want any windows on the back or anything like that. Just keep it all flat. I think. I think that's what we, I think that's what we want to do. Um, because I don't have a picture at the back, so uh, we just have to make it up on our own. That we just probably. Go like. Go something like that. Okay, I can see that. That looks uh, it looks pretty good. It looks fine for now, I guess. Uh, my picture has gone away, but we can continue doing the back. So that that would be like that, and then this one. I think it would just literally just go straight up. Like that, and then we have some stone brick on this level. Mm hmm. And then we bring light gray back, stone brick. Easy as that. I think that's the easiest job. And then we just bring that around, and this will come along, along there. Okay, that looks pretty sick. Um, I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of that clay. No, that looks pretty good. Yeah, I like it. But for these ones, we probably want, I want, want that one, this one out by one. Then we bring this line to here. And then this one could come in by one, like that. Hmm. Maybe we bring this, no. I think you go. I think we go like. I think that's the best choice, just because I think that's the best we have to do for this. If we can fit like a very thin. I mean, like a three block, four block wide building, a very good looking building. Yeah, I think that's the best that we could do. So maybe you could have some some line right here. So maybe some sort of line there. So that's a, so we could break up the buildings. My goal is just to try to uh, break up some of the buildings. So we just literally copy the front to the back. So we just go like go like that. Uh, go something like this. We just have to fill it up. Pretty easy, pretty easy, guys. Pretty easy, guys. Um, this can come along here. So we don't have to worry about this part connecting. But we do this part, so we just have to wrap this part around. But I think you guys get the memo, so what I'm going to do, uh, I'll tell you guys what to do. Just so you guys don't get frustrated that I cut away. 
So you just go, go like that, and then if we go gray around here. Perfect. I think that looks pretty cool. Yeah, that actually looks that actually looks pretty sick. So I'm going to cut away, do the rest of the backs, and then we're going to focus on some more detail up front. So I'll do this last one off camera. So I'll be right back. Give me two minutes, guys. Okay, we're back, and I've done a few things. I've finished off the back, which I think it looks pretty good. No need for that much detail from the back. I also f uh, filled in the roof, and then we'll do all that stuff afterwards. But the building is, uh, structurally wise, it's done. Uh, but we could say that we could add so much um, more detail to this building. Like, first of all, we could add these upside down stairs. Um, uh, to the stone brick parts like this uh, so yeah you there uh, stone brick along there uh, that's pretty much just there's some stone brick along there I think there was some windows along here as well so we can do that as well perfect and uh, that's one thing and I think we've done it all in the spruce wood one so I think that's good as well oh, this door is a little bit one too high um, and the next thing, hmm, window, window design. I think we want to go with white stained glass. I think it works perfectly for all windows, uh, all designs. So I think we'll go with, yeah, white stained glass. Uh, we don't want to, uh, go with more than one different kind of window, so. We go with some white stained glass everywhere. Like on these gray ones, since we can't do upside down stairs, we're gonna have to put in some some sort of detail there. But uh, we go like this windows. Um, oh my god, there's so many windows. Okay, <laughs> even down here is a big window, big large window here I guess there's some interior space so uh, if you guys built it like me uh, you guys could do it in own, your own interior I probably won't be doing the interior so um, geez I remember the windows on the side as well there's so many windows on this building um, uh, and then you there Even a small window at the back. And then one more window here. Then we want to go with a window sill. That looks pretty good. I like the white. It fits up with everything. So, um, window sills, I think, for the... I think for the stone brick ones, we go with quartz, and then we go with spruce for the dark oak ones, and then we go with smooth stone where the the gray ones. So, um, quartz, we'll go with the stone brick. So, what's that? Um, window sills along here. So, any stone brick windows, add, so add quartz. Perfect. I think that was it. Yeah. And then you gray ones are gonna get smooth stone. So we're gonna go smooth. Even the any gray ones. Um, I think I'd rather just save that for like a bench or something like that. So you're gonna go. You're gonna get some window sills along there. Um, I think there's one over here. Oh, that's stone brick one. Okay, and then you guys are going to get some spruce. I think that looks pretty good to me. Okay, that look, it's starting to get there. It's starting to get there. I feel like it's missing a little bit, uh, a little bit of uh, bits and bobs here and there. Um, we could go with some trap with some trap doors. 
with uh, I think only on the dark oak ones. So we had uh, you guys going here. Uh, yeah, trapdoors. Along there. Ooh, I think that one actually looks pretty good. I was going to use oak, but I don't like how they're, they're see-through, so. Yeah, I think the, these, these work out perfectly. Perfect, perfect. Um, here, and one more here. And down here, uh, he's probably going to get the path down. Wrong one. The path, I always use this block. I think it looks like the most realistic texture of a path. So, we got a sidewalk, but... Okay, we add you there. I think I'd just probably go like that, probably. Um, okay, so that's looking pretty good. Now, some sort of detail. I think if we add some silverfish, some mossy, because these are old shops. So I think if we add some moss to it, some cracks to it. Like, we do them. I think that looks pretty good. I feel like we need a little bit more mossy. Not too much. I don't want to ruin the building too much. So we go like one there, one there, one there. Uh, no, no mossy in the back, I don't think. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. And that's, I think some quartz, there's some sort of quartz, something like this. Kind of like an overhang eBay. <gasps> yeah, I think that looks good. Even on here as well. <gasps> Perfect, I think. I think that's all the detail we need for this building. I think this building's done, guys. I think this building building's done. Um, like always, lowstone all the windows so it brights up at nighttime. If you're uh, building your own city, do this, especially if you're doing it on console edition. It's gonna look so, so cool, and it's so worth doing. So it's not even that hard to do. So there's no excuse there. So. Oh, oh, we do those windows. We go like... Um... I think that's done, guys. Yeah, look at those row shops. I think those look pretty good. It's, it looks really good across the street from these shops. These shops kind of look like very small shops. I don't know. These shops look pretty sick as well. You look kind of like an office type building. And then we could start like a little district here. We could do like another row of shops, like a very thin one, but tall one. And then we could have another row of shops like along here as well. So I think we could start like a little row of shops there. I still have to do that. But I think guys, from a distance, they look pretty sick. Yeah. I think it looks pretty good. But anyway, guys, we're going to be here. So if you're going to enjoy this episode, please hit the like button. If you have ready, Please subscribe. We should see you in the next episode. Bye.